Uncensored Truth right here on ISBC Truth Channel with your host, Pastor Michael Smith and co-host, Sister Smith, baby. Sister Smith, baby. And if you are new to this channel, you just stumble across this channel. If this is your first time here, simply hit that subscribe button. Next to that subscribe button is that bell. Hit that bell so you'll be notified when we drop this breaking news on you. Next to that, there is a like button. Hit that like button so we can stay lit. Hit that like button so we can stay lit. Got some more breaking news for you people. Some more breaking news. Drake. As you know, or you know, Drake, you know what I'm saying? If you haven't tuned into our um, Sunday night podcast, we were speaking about Drake and him painting his nails. Paying homage to the false fallen angel deity. What's his name? Who? The yellow, yellow, the color yellow. What is the deity? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. That's a lady. Yeah, it's, a, it's a lady. So Drake is paying homage to a female deity called Oshun. Her color is the color yellow. So that is who Drake was paying homage to in, well, when he was rocking the color yellow as far as painting his nails. Not only that, he did that on the month of Pride Month. It's Pride Month, people. And who is the top artist to celebrate Pride Month? Well, no other than your flamboyant boyfriend, Drake. Drizzy Drake. They call him Drizzy, but his name is Drake. Lord, Lord, Lord. Let me tell you something, people. Let's go ahead and hear this. What's going on with Drake? Okay, um... Make sure you guys hit the, that like button. If you haven't hit that like button yet, you got to hit that like button. That's what makes this truth get out to the masses, people. So hit that like button. If you're new to this channel, hit okay. that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bells. Go ahead. Okay, Drake's facing money troubles. His credit card was declined on live stream. Okay, his credit card was declined on live stream. That does not mean he is facing money troubles. Sometimes when you when you make abnormal purchases outside of your normal spend, spending patterns, the bank automatically blocks your card until you identify that it's you just to protect yourself. You know, we're living in a world where all you got and all you see is people trying to skim, scam, and flam you, trying to cipher you out your credit card numbers. You know what I'm saying? Ain't that right, Sister Smith? Yes. So that's what banks do, credit card companies do, you know what I'm saying, to protect you. And it, it happened to me a lot. Well, not a lot, but it happened to me. You understand? And I'm not getting mad at the bank. I thank the bank for protecting me because if that happened and the bank didn't protect me, guess what? I will be out. You see? So I thank the bank, you know what I'm saying, for using that mechanism. So, But is he broke? Well, let me tell you something. i tell you what. The only thing that Drake can use his money for is the things that they tell him he, that he can use his money for. But if he went and seen you, went to your house and gave you $100,000 without the permission of the higher-ups, it would be his you-know-what, Mr. Postman. It would be. See, these celebrities only can are able to yeah, they may be called billionaires and trillionaires and all this other stuff, but they are only able to do for those that they are only able to do for. They are only able to buy things for the things, the people that they are only able to buy things for. See? But go ahead. Um, hip hop superstar Drake is known for lavishly opening 
his wallet. But is he doing too much? Over the weekend, Canadian rapper Drake had his credit card decline on Kick Live. Pretty embarrassing. No, it's not embarrassing. It's not at all. Because if you are known to have money and your credit card declined, don't automatically think that he's broke. Understand that maybe it is um, uh, um, an issue with uncommon spending patterns. You see, these young folks are so naive and they're so lost and confused. And the first thing they can think of, oh, he's broke, he's broke. Um, he's not broke. Because he can only spend what he want, what what they want him to spend on. But as far as being broke, I don't think he's broke. I just look at it as he done spent a little bit too many times. He done uses, especially if you use your card, like five or six different times in like the past uh, twenty minutes. That would cause a red flag. And the bank will put a stop to that until you call in to get that clarified. Ain't that right, Sister Smith? Yep, that's it. You know what I'm saying? But you don't say social media and the Negroes on social media, they just, you know what I'm saying, dumbfounded. Go ahead. Make sure you guys hit the that like button if you haven't done so already. Hit that like button. If you're new to this channel, hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bells. You are tuned in to Breaking News right here on ISBC Truth with your host, Pastor Michael Smith, and okay. co-host, Sister Smith Bay. Sister Smith Bay Bay. Go ahead. Over the weekend, no, I read that part. Uh, Drake went live on Kick and tried to tip a streamer five hundred dollars, but his credit card declined. Uh, embarrassing. Tip a streamer five, and that's and he probably is not um mm -hmm. uh or tip a streamer how much five hundred dollars five hundred dollars. Lord, Lord, oh Lord, you know what I'm saying? If the, if that streamer better be glad that his credit card declined. Why it had to be five hundred dollars? Do you know five represents Satan in the pure cipher? You know what I'm saying? If that streamer would have received that five hundred dollars, that would have been that streamer's destiny from that day forward. From that day forward, that streamer would have been like Maya Campbell, somewhere strung out on drugs and never able to come back to his mindset. This is how the this is how these celebrities do it. So it's a good thing that his fire his car declined. But is he out of money? No. His car probably declined because this kick, I never heard of kick, and um he probably really don't hardly use his card on Kick. And if you don't use your card on certain platforms, the bank recognizes that this is a new form of merchant that's processing this credit card. Let me put a block to it until Drake calls up to clarify that it's him. It's a protection. But go ahead. And that's not all. The rapper flies around the world in his own 747 jet and lives in nearly 100,000 square foot ca castle in Toronto uh, and has been stylish selling off pro properties over the last few year months. Selling off properties. To all you Canadians, you so busy lifting up Drake. Drake is selling off property. He's riding around in an expensive 747 jet. But yet, where is the um, help 
in the communities in Canada. I'm pretty sure there was a homeless situation in Canada too, like it is in America. And if it is, why I'll say it the same way I said about Jay-Z buying that house in California. Why? Look at this. Satan is something else, I tell you. So, no, so I say, like I said to Jay-Z, why don't Drake take some of that money and buy apartment complexes and house low-income families to help out his fellow Canadians? That would be logically right. If you got it like that, why don't you help out your people instead of doing this dumb stuff to do what? To have your people spend their hard-earned money on your music. Why don't you show something good? Buy apartment complexes and house low-income families. You know what I'm saying? Why don't you do that? It's single mothers in Canada that, you know what I'm saying, need help. Why don't you do that instead of trying to invite them to your mansion and sleep with them, Drake? Why don't you do that? Oh, I see. You can't do that because you can only spend on who they tell you to spend it on. Go ahead. Last month, the Grammy Award winning rapper an actor put up his Beverly Hills mega mansion for sale. Mm, mm, mm. Um, the the just nearly like, twenty just, acres. Just like Christ told the rich man, run and sell all that you have and give the money to the poor. The rich man went went off sobbing because his his mind was on his money. Go ahead. Well, it keep jumping out. All right. So. All right. All right. But I guess that's going to wrap that up. You know what I'm saying? Drake's credit card declined because of abnormal, abnormal um, spending patterns. Not because he's broke. You know what I'm saying? He's not broke. He's just use his card a little bit too many times in the past hour. And the bank said, oops. And especially if it's American Express. If it's American Express, oh, they are really strict on that. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, I'll wrap that up. I want to thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another edition of ISBC Truth. Breaking news right here on ISBC Truth with your host, Pastor Michael Smith. And co-host, Sister Smith Bay. Sister Smith Bay Bay. And if you are new to this channel, you just stumbled across this channel, this is your first time here, hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bells as you hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button as well. As you guys come in here, hit that like button. And uh, I think that's going to wrap it up. And then we'll see you on to the next one. You know what I'm saying? Stay tuned. Thursday nights at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, the live show. Sunday nights at 9 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, the live show. Don't forget to tune in. How you bless you all? How you bless you all? On the main line. On the main line.